Just after midnight on Saturday, the echo of a single shot reverberated through the dead of the night on Flamengo Avenue of the Bullet Tree Road in San Ignacio Town. A 21-year-old resident had been shot to the back by a lone gunman who exited some bushes and opened fire on Akeem Guzman. Guzman was rushed to the San Ignacio Community Hospital where he succumbed within hours. On Sunday, June 25, 2017, at about 12.50 a.m., based on information received, police um, responded to the information. They visited a, an address at Flamingo Avenue in San Ignacio Town where the, a male person identified as Akeem Alexander Guzman, 21 years, Belizean laborer of number 8, 8th Street, San Ignacio Town, was seen leaning against the wall of a bathroom building in the yard with an apparent gunshot wound to his back. The investigation reveals that he was along with a male person in the yard behind the house um, of a friend when a shot was fired, hitting him on his back. According to police, while the scene has been processed and several statements recorded, a motive for the crime has still not been ascertained. We haven't established a clear motive as yet. Uh, we, are, we are still um, conducting some interviews. Is Mr. So. Guzman um, known to the police? Yes, he has been dealt with by the police before. Okay. Um, is it believed to be gang related? No. The murder has left the entire family stunned because they spoke to Guzman just minutes before the shooting. According to his brother Oscar, Akeem went to the nearby shop and didn't return. He said that he was going to check the store to um, buy some cigarettes and then he would go home after that and that was the the last time that I saw and heard from him. When did you find out, when did you and your family find out what happened to Akeem? It was till around four o'clock yesterday morning when the police came and told my mom that Akeem had passed away. It is even more heart-wrenching for 20-year-old Oscar, who says that he and his brother had a very close relationship. I just like want to say that like I really miss him a lot, and like since that he's gone now, like I don't, I don't really know like how I can cope, cope around, and like with him he was always there for me whenever I needed him so like now since that he's gone like I don't really know like what else to do anyone with information on this latest homicide in the West is asked to contact the nearest police station or Crime Stoppers Belize at 0800-922-TIPS. Dwayne Moody for News 5.